What is a star? Are they more than just lights in the sky? This week on Space But Messier. Let's start with the brightest star in our sky. But you won't find it at night, because it's actually our very own sun. Planet Earth orbits around a medium-sized and fairly young star. And although it appears yellow, it's actually white in color. Now a star, like our sun, is a huge glowing ball of gas that forms in a cosmic cloud of gas and dust called a nebula. And over time, gravity pulls a bunch of this cloud towards a common center. It gets super dense, pressure rises, and the temperatures can reach up to a million degrees. Now over time, it gets hot enough to where it begins nuclear fusion. And that's when hydrogen turns into helium and eventually exerts an outward pressure. Now when this outward pressure equals that of the force of gravity pulling it in, it becomes balanced. And this is when the star's life begins. This state in which the star spends most of its life is known as hydrostatic equilibrium. In fact, most of the stars you see in the night sky are in this equilibrium. This balance lasts as long as there's hydrogen fuel. Once it's burned all of it up, that outward pressure stops existing and the gravity pulls the star and it collapses towards the center and possibly goes what we like to call supernova. 